Hola and bonjour. I'm right at the border between Spain and France. And I find borders in Europe really evocative, and this one in particular. So here we see, this is where the Pyrenees Mountains actually come down and hit the Mediterranean. And we were driving up here and we came upon this border station. And here we have where you used to have to stop and change money and show your passport and all of that. In fact, here it says Espanol and Police Francaise, the French police right there. And uh, you'd have your, your nerve wracking station. I remember you had to you know, pull out your passport and you didn't know if they're, how carefully they're going to look what you do. And, and it used to be complicated. And gazing in here, I don't know how many years it's been, but there's actually a, an exchange board. And if you read that carefully, you can see it says Franks and Pesetas. And here you'd have to unload all your old uh, currency from the last country and you pick up currency from the new country. Today we don't have to do that. Today these border stations are just remnants of a time when Europe was much more fragmented. And it's fascinating as travelers to celebrate, to celebrate how far Europe has come in becoming one integrated free trade zone of 400 million people. 300 million of them have the same coins jangling in their pockets. Transportation networks go, you know, blind to borders very efficiently from capital to capital. I remember days when you'd, in the middle of the night, on your night train from, from France to Madrid, you'd get off here because there was two different gauges on the train. And you'd have to go from the French gauge to the Spanish gauge. And right now, you just swing right by, celebrating the opportunity to travel more efficiently than ever in Europe. So we're going from France to Spain, enjoying the scenery along the way. Happy travels.